Tinalanga ndi firo da mulaudzi ndo bebelwa chimbupe malonga musanda wa mulikiti nda yenda chitambela Canberra United or Australia I'm from, from the village I'm a demukololo meaning I'm a princess so it wasn't easy for me to follow my dreams because there were a lot of challenges especially when it comes to where I come from I need to do all the princess duties but I had to disobey the families or what I was being told to do because football is something that I loved from the young age. 2015, I received my first uh, Banyana collab under coach Perapau. And then it happened that I got injured. We had to go under, under con surgery and it took me six months to get back to the field of play. At first, I told myself that it's over with my career. I'm just going to play domestic or leagues, maybe Sasso League. Then only to find that there are still big things that are waiting for me out there. I joined Canberra United uh, 2018 in August. I was, I don't know how to put it, but it was a good feeling, mixed emotions. I wasn't sure whether to take the opportunity, but sometimes you never know unless you try. At first, I had a lot of doubt, especially when I signed the contract that side, like, oh, I'm playing with big names in Australia, these people they play in the US. Would I even make it in the first 11? Would I even score? But hey, guess what? I managed to do that. And you know, with us, when you're from Africa, when you go overseas, you think you, you won't make it. You think you're not gonna do it. You think you're not perfect for, for, for playing overseas. But that's what I'm saying, living it means you can do anything, especially when you tell yourself that, you know what, I'm good enough. Sasolik and Banyana played a huge role for us to manage to see ourselves getting a contract that side. Because if it wasn't because of the national team and also the Sasolik, maybe it would have been difficult for us to impress the coach. My father, he's my role model. He, him being from a royal family and able to support me throughout the journey, and it wasn't easy for him to oppose the, our culture, especially us as Bakololo, but he managed to support me all the way. What I can say to young girls is anything is possible and don't let anyone tell you that you can't make it. As long you have a dream, as long you, you stay focused, you're committed and love what you're doing, you can reach whatever, you can go wherever you want to go. We are powerful, beautiful, limitless, and we got this.